welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Courtney and this is Defining Sheep, a place for beauty, lifestyle, and fashion all on a budget. So make sure you like, subscribe, and comment below. You can also find me on Instagram as well as TikTok, Defining Sheep, and my blog page, DefiningSheep.com. So today's video is going to be a beauty haul. So I got a couple of items um, from Sephora and I ordered a few things offline. So it's going to be a really quick video. Um, I just wanted to show you guys some of the things that I picked up. So these past couple of weeks, I don't know what's been going on with my skin, but I've been having a couple of breakouts. Um, I've suffered from hormonal acne for years. So like this is something that's not new at all. And I've been dealing with, like I said, a couple of years now. So I went into Sephora and I picked up a couple of items, just a few little pieces, um, you know, to help with some of my skin issues that I'm um, having right now. So the first item that I picked up was, um, I got the trial size because again, I have sensitive skin on top of acne prone skin. So I didn't want to try something that would make me break out even more. But I know like with most products, they do have a purging process where, you know, they try to get out, you know, all the bacteria and things of that nature. But I started off with this Paula's Choice Exfoliate. And this was actually $10 for the small travel size. Um, it's 2% BHA liquid exfoliant and um, it's recommended for all skin types and it's supposed to unclog and shrink in large pores, smooth and even skin tone. So um, I have been using this for a couple of days now. It's working pretty good, like I don't have any complaints. Um, I don't feel like it's drying or it made my skin any worse. So I definitely will probably um, buy this again, but just in a larger amount. I also picked up these products from The Ordinary. One is lactic acid, 10%. Now, this specifically targets uneven skin tone, texture issues, as well as fine lines. Now, I only use this once since I've gotten it. So, here it is. And... Again, I didn't have any issues so far with it. Like I said, I only used it one time. I didn't have any like additional, um, you know, breakouts or um, like any peeling or anything like that. Cause I know like that can be a huge concern for a lot of people, especially if you have to go out and you know, uh, with different chemicals that you're using. So you have to be really careful. And again, I have sensitive skin. So I did also purchase this. My apologies, my bag kind of fell over. I also got the um, Ordinary, is it Azalic Acid Suspension 10%. Now, I have used this in the past. This is actually my second bottle. I really did like this. Um, I felt like it worked pretty well. Didn't have any complaints about it. It did um, curb the acne um, from future breakouts. So, of course, I got a little you know, um, got a little carried away. I got a little bit too comfortable and because my face started clearing up, I pretty much stopped using it. And you know, I was good for a couple of weeks, but now I'm having some breakouts on my chin. So I started using this again and it also targets uneven skin tone, dullness and any texture issues. So if you have like enlarged pores or, you know, things of that nature, you have some acne scarring, I would definitely recommend this. And both of these products, the lactic acid as well as the um, azelaic acid were both under $10 and these were all from Sephora. Next, I ordered this actually for the holidays. This is the Laura Mercier um, Translucent Honey. Um, I got this from Nordstrom and it came in because I got it around the holiday season. It came like a little ornament. Now this is actually a sample size. So this isn't the full one and it's the translucent honey, as you can see, but I feel like it was a good size. I want to say it was $11. Um, for this, I have not used it because lately I have just been using um, my Maybelline Loose Powder in a color medium, I want to say. So once I use that up, I'll officially start using the, as they say, the Holy Grail, the Laura, um, Laura Mercier. I also picked this up from Sephora. Um, it's a 
Sephora Favorites Perfume Sampler. It actually comes with several different sample size perfumes, but what I did like the most, not only can you sample the different fragrances, you also get a scent certificate um, to go along. So whatever scent that you like the most, you can actually redeem it for the larger um, travel size roller ball. So I paid $25 for this and let's see what's inside. Here's my scent certificate right here. And this is what it looks like. So it has Replica, Tom Ford, Valentino, um, Nest. It has a YSL fragrance, um, Libre. And it also has My Way. And what is this? I can't see this one. Oh, and it has Flower Bomb in this one. So that is from Sephora. And I also got this one. Actually, my mom bought this for me um, for Christmas. And this is a 21-piece set from Macy's. And it's also a discovery set and it has samplers. But this one was actually on sale for the holiday. Let me see how I can open this up. So, and I thought the box was just absolutely... What the, how cute that is. And it has all of those fragrance fragrances as well so it literally has calvin klein cartier it has coach dolce and gabbana um dkny giorgio armani givenchy juicy michael kors prada ralph lauren rebecca minkoff um sam edelman um, Valentino, it has Versace, um, it has so many fragrances. This is a 21 piece set. And again, it was on sale. And I also know that they have these in Dillard's as well, um, because I actually saw it on someone's TikTok after I purchased the one <laughs> from Sephora. So I just wanted to do a really quick video. Like I said, some of these are some of the beauty things that I bought over the past couple of weeks. I know that I do say, um, you know, Define the Chic is lifestyle, beauty, and fashion. And I know like the past few hauls have, you know, been pretty much closed. So I wanted to share this with you guys. And if you have any questions, I have this um, two-piece set in um, pajama set. Actually, I was fil filming a Reels <laughs> for Instagram earlier. So I have this and it's from Shein. It was $20 and it gives me very much Victoria's Secret. So um, I will put all that information if I can find the links to all of these things and they're still in stock. I will put this information down in the description box and hopefully I will see you soon. Thanks again for watching and make sure you leave a comment below, like and subscribe. Thank you. Take care guys.